and how to get respect from men. I meet a lot of women that say they have trouble getting taken seriously by guys. A lot of them even have trouble getting basic respect, right? basic decency. Um, a guy might not respect your thoughts, or your mind, or even your body or your boundaries. Um, when I meet these women, I often ask them about the habits and the behaviors that they exhibit around the men that they like. Most of the time, they've made some concessions in what they would normally do for guys that they like, that they would not do for guys that they're not attracted to or that they don't like. Making those concessions and those exceptions in your conduct with certain men simply because you like them starts to lead to a guy measuring you to be something that you might not be. He starts to judge you for the type of person you appear to be rather than the type of person you might be. And he's not necessarily wrong to do this because you are exhibiting behaviors that give him an idea of what you would accept from him. People in general, but guys specifically, start to respect you based upon what they believe you offer to the world and you offer to yourself. They also respect you based on how you allow people to treat you and how you present yourself. If you presented yourself to be way too lenient, way too fluid in what you would accept and what you would require from people in friendships and relationships, even in a professional setting, some people will hold that against you. When a man imagines you as his woman, he wants to imagine you as strong and capable of taking care of yourself. He doesn't want to imagine you as someone who needs to be told exactly what to do in every situation or someone who would accept someone treating her bad that he would then have to do something about all the time. He doesn't want to imagine you as someone who would allow another man to encroach upon her boundaries and upon his standards. A man wants to know that if somebody goes too far with you and you're their woman, you're going to put the brakes on it. You're going to stop them. You're going to put a wall up. A lot of times a man's sense of security in a relationship has so much more to do with the boundaries that his woman sets that if he notices you don't have boundaries, or have standards for the men you encounter that aren't your man, he may not trust you or your ability to be a faithful spouse. So with that said, the first thing that might garner a man's respect from the very beginning is you exhibiting healthy boundaries. So many women, again, put down their boundaries when they like a guy. The problem is he can't tell if that's something that you're doing for him or if that's something that you just do for all men. If you appear to let men mishandle you, then he won't trust you as his spouse or his woman. Nobody wants their woman getting felt on, touched on, talked down to by other men when she's away from them. He has to be able to trust your conduct with men when he's not around. And if he can't, he'll either worry or become insecure because he doesn't think that you'll stop a guy who's going too far. When you show a guy healthy boundaries, while it might make things more difficult for him to move forward with you, while it might make things harder for him to you know, experience new things with you or get access to you, he can respect it because he knows that you don't take yourself too lightly and that you're going to require work and respect from anybody you encounter. That puts him in rare company. Guys want to feel like they're with someone who's rare and special or with someone who requires you to be rare and special. Guys measure themselves up against other guys a lot, and if it doesn't appear that you need to be a decent enough man or a quality person to get close to you, then a guy will assume that you're letting any guy, no matter how stupid he is, no matter how irresponsible he is, no matter how disrespectful he is, he'll imagine that if he's gotten that close to you that quickly without somehow earning his time with you, then another man has done it the same. If you've given yourself and your time and your attention easily enough to him, he'll assume that other guys have not had to pass through very many walls to get to you. And unfortunately enough, again, that makes you look like an unsecured door with no locks. Men want to know that their women are going to have it locked down when they're away from them. And so that starts with every interaction that you have when a guy's getting to know you, even from the very beginning. He needs to see that you keep control of the pace. You need to show that you have healthy boundaries, even if that means correcting him. He'll respect you in the long run for it and he'll trust you more if the relationship progresses.